JC has been invoked by our president, Jay-Z. This is not the first time South Africa's president has unequivocally declared that the ANC will rule until the son of man, JC, comes back. <laughs> he was first criticized by religious leaders shortly before the presidential elections when he invoked the name of Jesus to illustrate the ruling party's hold on power. Then again, recently in Mpumalanga, Jay-Z thanked supporters for voting for the ANC. He then reminded them that the power will be in the ANC's hands until the second coming. <laughs> These controversial statements can be viewed to be extremely similar to a statement by Zimbabwe's president, Robert Mugabe, who stated that only God can remove him from power. <laughs> With me tonight uh, is Dr. Spades Makatsulu, a religious expert, and Pastor J.J. McCulkin, an evangelist pastor from the all-new Sycophants Church. <laughs> Good evening, gentlemen. Good evening. Good evening, Darren. We'll start off with you, Dr. Makatsulu. Is the president correct? Will the ANC rule until JC comes back? The president is indeed correct. The ANC will rule South Africa until the Son of Man comes back. What empirical evidence do you have to support this? On the day the ANC was formed in uh, 1912, several pastors were at the momentous occasion and were on hand to bless the newly formed liberation organization. And that blessing anointed the ANC and sealed their divine right to rule as they saw fit. That's right, Gary. The ANC alone deserves to rule until the second coming. You see, Jay-Z <laughs> suffered like Jay-Z. He was called names and betrayed. It is the same suffering Mr. Zuma has had to bear. Jay-Z had disciples. There, the same can be said about Jay-Z. He had many disciples. Amen. Mm. Jay-Z rose from a proverbial graveyard of politics post Paula yeah. yeah. He answered our prayers through his hand. He rid us of those Lucifer-anointed scorpions. And praise be to him. Uh, praise be to whom? Jay-Z. 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 What he said. But in this deeply religious country of ours, isn't it dangerous to assert or to infer in the slightest that the ANC rules by divine right, that the ANC alone should be in power, that to vote against ANC is to oppose God? Isn't that dangerous in a democracy? It's not, Darren. This is freedom of speech, freedom that was given to us by the ANC. We must never forget that. Hallelujah. <laughs> Gee. G for justice, G for Jay-Z. It's all the same. What's in a name? Darren, don't play that game. Freedom, are you free or are you dumb? Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> Just let anyone in here. Eh?